Hey guys, uh, we are back with Life is Strange. Um, I'm just loading up the stream just so I can see. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> just so I can see the chat. Um, I'll make sure the sound's working. <laughs> yeah, it is. Excuse me. Oh. There we go. That's all set up correctly. That's what I need. Hi guys. Um, Gaming Pigeon here, and we are back with Life is Strange. Um, it is going to be a short one today um but i just wanted to get a little bit into it after streaming the horror game i thought we could use a little bit of a like a bit more story although that did have a great storyline um this is a little bit calmer but let's get into it Oh yeah, we're wearing some of Rachel's clothes, aren't we? Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Check you out, Max. Ready for the runway. Go downstairs and show Joyce. She'll love it. Ugh, it still reeks like a chlorine factory. I might as well start blazing if I was dumb enough to get suspended for weed. <sighs> At least we haven't been identified yet. Breaking and vandalism, yeah. <laughs> Please arrest the nude man with a sword. <laughs> okay, how did I never read that before? <laughs> I have to go, especially since Kate's parents aren't going to bury her here. <sighs> yeah, I don't know if I like her parents so much. Oh my god. That smells so amazing. Oh, let's have a look. You were saying you did all that was possible and Kate's life was never in your hands, or even hers at that point. So she'll always be with us. And I know she wants you to... Long okay. It's like when we were kids here. I better not go in there. David might be in bed. Ew. Nobody in this town has a fucking clue as to what's happening. Do they? Frodo! I do love that you can take photos in this game. I don't know if I like that photo. There's still a photo. I got a trophy. Yours toothbrush. What's ironic is I always hated it when Chloe used my toothbrush. Hair dye. Can I dye her hair? I haven't gone through a dyeing my hair blue phase yet. 
Maybe it's time. Chloe would probably love that if he did that. Chloe has had this damn dirty pirate towel since we were kids. <laughs> Serious flashback. Why is there a bird in here? Can I... No way. That's the bluebird I saved Monday in Joyce's room. Oh, I can't take a photo. Okay. See if I can go back into Chloe's room. She's still in the same position. She has not moved. You are not baking. You are just awake. I felt like a fly landed on my head then. Check that you out, rude. Max. Ready for the runway. Go downstairs and show Joyce. She'll love it. You're not going to bake first. Her. That was my 10th birthday. I didn't know Chloe kept Aww. this stuff. He's cute. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. Mm. is please come back. Mm. You have no comments on the condoms, okay. And the music cannot be heard because it's copyright. What's in the drawer? Wow, I remember this old phone. We decorated it together. For the comics. Let's go have a look downstairs. Down the stairs we go. Go downstairs. Looks like a message. David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break ins. Oh dear. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Let's rewind if I can remember how. I'm going to erase it. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe has earned a break from all this bullshit. That's a really this good. might be the one time these people are right. <laughs> oh, yeah, because we've got a tornado coming at us, haven't we? So. Who drinks beer this early around here? Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Wow. Bottom of the page. <sighs> That's sad. Open the window. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Oh yeah, Kate's I've just looked at that sure one, I did. Nice exploitive headline. Yes, yes, you already said that. It must be Chloe and her dad. Wait. Oh, look at the poor bird. This bird scary. be gone. Fly, you fool. <laughs> I love that line. Fly, you fool! I get to scare the bird again so he goes out the window. There we go. 
Can we see another one outside? Dead bird. Poor thing. Oh. Birdie, birdie. Hotel! There's apparently a few different ones you can get. A few I've missed. Hmm. Okay. Did I miss loads in episode one? I did miss what? Oh, I only missed two. I missed two in episode one. I missed loads in episode two. Hmm. Or any other episode three. So let's. Why is there more dead birds? I wonder how these birds died. I never figure out the dead birds. Sitting in a swing always feels so comforting. I remember when Chloe and me would take turns in the swing. We would push each other so hard we'd fly way up in the air. Chloe always wanted to swing all the way around. I always got scared and would jump off before I flew off. And Chloe is still trying to get high. Aww. Not the best way to look at it. Wow, there's loads Three of birds. Dead birds lined up. That's fucking ominous. How do I not remember all the dead birds? Okay, I can't go in there. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Joyce looks so different in her street clothes. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel, uh, I, I mean Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chat about. Ooh. Eggs and bacon. Eggs and I really bacon want eggs and bacon. Remember when you guys would sleep in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. Mm. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. I can handle eggs and bacon. Can you? Eggs. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chat now. Open the fridge. I should evolve and become a vegan, but... Oh, bacon. Why? Bacon's way too nice. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in LA. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. I 
I hate to even think this, much less say it out loud, but I think Rachel is in serious trouble. I know. I watch those awful true crime shows, and it makes me ill if I think about Rachel ending up on one. So I don't think too much. I see why Chloe is so obsessed with finding her. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Maybe. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. She was. <laughs> you think? You're cool too, because you got your camera. has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me, what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, you. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. No. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, <laughs> you can clean. Bring those eggs and bacon to my belly. Oh, I was hoping I could take a photo like a lot of people do of their own food today. You would have thought Chloe would be down already. Apparently not, we're just going to watch me eat. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Yeah. I said look at the food. What? Okay, can I get up? Seeing you again. Ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite oh, this is where we find that. Take pictures like, you make all the photos Max from Chloe, Chloe Max's past and find out we can go He's back. Great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this and... and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. Yeah, I didn't show you that this too. to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. Chloe's dad she was died hopeful, positive. That day. Everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do oh, yeah, need to get searching. into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Okay. Uh... Nothing in it. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military. I can even see the combination. 
That might Seven be a useful one. password. Seven one. Maybe I could try Stepdad for the password. Nothing to see here. Chloe can't get another gun now. Unless she steals it back from Frank. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. the license number for the password okay so we've got a few different things we can try What's in the book looks like david has read this a lot what did he learn obviously david's parents care about him that date might be a good password Okay, so we've got a few different ones. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. might be a useful password. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Let's go army. Nope. Uh, family. Score! Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. Yeah. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Why do they... Yeah, that's weird. I better tell Chloe about this now. Oh, it's just one more thing to make her sad. And mad. Just wanted to say thanks that you actually give a shit about me and my mum. You cared about Kate when no one else did. So unfair that you got us from that. Oh, that's nice of her. Huh? 
Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. Must be nice to be suspended and have some free time off Blackwell. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? I'm gonna side with You're Chloe. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Uh oh. You're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You Shit. can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. Oh. Okay, now I, I feel hope a little Joyce bit doesn't bad. hate me for tearing into David. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. When you... Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? <sighs> shit, I still feel bad. Because Chloe's right, he shouldn't have that shit, but... Even breaking up a family Max, hard. that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Yeah, let's go. I still feel bad, Listen, but let's go. When I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. Rachel's too. Uh, Chloe's too fucking volatile to do anything. Wasted, like he this. sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... <laughs> she Chloe, can piece this I got up. this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. What the hell is this? Ugh, oh, 
gross. I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. What were the things we gotta... Photograph? I'm gonna look for them now. Like, purposefully. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. Did you get a text message? Is that what that was? It was! From Dad. more concerned about me not to do where I go to school. Another dead bird. Why is there so this many is dead so birds? Creepy. I don't like the dead birds. No, I'm not going to look at the dead bird again. No. No, 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 no. Oh. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? A tornado? I hope not. Could be worse. We could get one of those California quakes. True. Well, I'm feeling a little dizzy now. Hope you catch the big one today. I better. Too late to switch careers now. See you around, kid. I'd love to do a whole big rig photo series. That would actually be really cool. Can I take the phone? I don't want to go that way. I know you don't. I'm trying to get in a better position hey, to take that no photo. Girl. What? I know a photo. What hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Having a bad day at the office? Some punks messed with the train tracks, and now I have to wait for three days until I get my cargo. Time is money for a guy like me. Oh, oh yeah, that sucks. Wish I could drive right out of goddamn Arcadia Bay. The whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, that slut suicide. Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? And even that shifty Rachel What's-Her-Face asked me once if I'd drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Well, you're a dick. I'd love to do a whole big rig photo series. It's not going to let me take the photo, is it? Because you're a dick. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel? 
She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those... You know who know what. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. Hmm. Still don't like you. But I do actually like the truck. The truck is actually pretty cool. Can I still talk to you? Let's you talk about my photo shoot later. 10 4. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. You'd never know how weird this town is by these postcards. Really? Because one of the postcards is just a kitten. Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of Beans. I could chug this beer or dump it on Frank. Beer is gross, so turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? Let's try spilling the beer. I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Nope. Doesn't work. Let's try speaking to her. You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your You're keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Uh, maybe not. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans! <laughs> 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 Nope. Okay, none of that worked. Maybe we all did. Oh, that was dark. What are the other signs then? The fire walker has been scratched out. The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. That doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns. No, but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather. That doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Dr. Hedora, will your team know more after their latest tests? I hope we see more patterns, which gives us an atmospheric template. Many local residents of Arcadia Bay have been questioning what has been you look going weird. on with this crazy weather. We had an eclipse yesterday. Uh, so <laughs> it sounds like you've been thinking that. That's just you know, funny. It's not common this time of year. It's unprecedented, to be honest with you. Uh, the last time that we had a snowstorm of this caliber was over a hundred years ago. All of us are questioning what is happening in Arcadia Bay. Lots of Please things are happening. Call in and let me know what your experience has been. 
what you think this might be is this global warming what is causing all of this crazy weather Just look at it quickly. Review. Yeah. How you doing, Maxine? I'm Maxine. so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're definitely proud of you going Max. up there. Thanks, I do Officer like the name Maxine. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but Max it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. How you doing, Maxine? Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it... I'm glad you're representing Black Bullet Cat. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. How you doing, Maxine? Thanks, officer. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull. Mm, Kate I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. Such a waste. Awful. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame <laughs> you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. What can I do for you, Max? I feel like David Matt. Not for long. He's eager to be. That's true. Hmm. Rachel. Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh look, Max Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you tweet bitch. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Ooh. Let's try that. You have serious balls, little girl. David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. 
Oh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? <laughs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. Shit. I'll back off. Ah. What? What? This? Come on, go back. Excuse me. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Fuck, David there's Madsen gonna be something is... else that I'm missing. Oh, I'm trapped. What can I do for you, Max? Do you think Arcadia Bay is... I'd take a normal suit. Uh, missing something, I just don't know what. Holy shit, what do you want now? I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than a narc on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Are you fucking stupid? Get out of my space. Okay, don't I be a dick. Said that. I'll need to rewind. Safe talking to Frank. What the fuck now? <laughs> Holy shit, what? Uh, Weren't you day. supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Holy shit, what do you want now? I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Okay. What can I do for you, Max? Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You couldn't bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. To his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs. 
kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? Yeah, let's try. What the fuck now? You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Fuck. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. Nope, we're gonna rewind and you're not gonna know I've taken your fucking keys, you dickhead. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. Open the door. I'm going to stop by the door. Are you shitting me? Oh. What? what? I'd love to talk, Max, but I'm drowning in puddle scum. Okay, can you just run? Watch out! Quick thinking, Max. Whew. That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. I saw you try and save my friend Gate on that roof. The only one who did. While people took camera pics. Kate was my friend, too. I would have done anything to save her. Everybody saw that. I'm proud of you for being so brave. You're pretty cool, Max. That's not how I feel today, but thanks. We need to hang out more. Drink some wine. I have to go, but let's talk later, cool? Thanks again, Max. Talk to you later. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Get the treat, treat, boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Oh. Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. <laughs> Munching on his bone. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy! Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Daydreaming.
You scope the area I while I quite picture Frank and Chloe drinking beer and hanging out. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place, I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. Chloe isn't scared. She's loving this. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Crappy wife out here. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. How can somebody live like this? Sorry, I'm not very talkative tonight. I'm really sorry. I do like this game and I get so invested that I don't actually <laughs> talk while I'm playing. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Ooh, Frank's stash. Hmm. No more secrets. Hmm. Where's the feather? That's almost cute to see Frank posing Aww. with his dog. That is actually cute. It's not almost cute, it is cute. I could pry this vent open with the right tool. Okay, so both are vents are apparently loose. Is Frank going to deal online now? Newbie's guide to a web business. Okay. Why? That's a Bloke. pretty extreme lighter. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Mm. There is something. Mm, I work, but no prize here. Uh, there could be something else. Frank must have a reason to keep a police <laughs> radar nearby. Oh, yeah. That would be so cool to take this baby on the road with Chloe. It would. Pompidou? <laughs> For reals? That's a poodle's name. Oh, good. Mm. Presto, Chloe's gun. Should I give it back to her? Uh, fuck yeah, let's do it. Last time I played this game, I did not find the gun. I have a terrible present for you. An ounce of dank bud? Oh, you so rule, Max. Thank you. I feel so much better now. You better bring it back to David right away. Yeah, yeah, sure. sure. I'm, on it. I'm on it. Yeah, she's not going to. She's going to just keep it. No. I might regret this, but I can't let Frank hurt someone. This is almost as good as a set of keys. Yeah, I don't know where I set keys are. I hope it doesn't break. Damn! Curses! Nothing here. Broke. My blade will open any portal. Ooh. I cannot believe he would wear What is this? Oh man. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Sorry about the last night. I was being. 
I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Oh. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. I've never seen you act that way. And the next time is the last. I'm with Leo and we don't look back. I care about you, or so maybe we need to break our routine. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a stepfucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! Oh, shit. Your dog's out and you're just casually still eating beans. Okay. Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. You gotta take responsibility. Grow the fuck up. And I'm not trying to be mean, but you're not the only one in Arcadia Bay with problems. Kate Marsh killed herself, you know? Yes, Kate Marsh killed herself. She's dead. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel better about my fucked up life, get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know yeah. that, Max. My mom actually blames herself. Just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes, even I blame her. No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. You don't want to hear this, but you're still here, alive, with me, and that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me, and Rachel needs you. Stop being a bitch. Dick. I know you're hurting because your dad died, but your stepdad's a dickhead. There's no need to treat a lot. Like that. 
Oh my oh. god. Oh yeah. What is happening now? This is where we get to go back in time. This part's really cool. I do love this part. I never expected it from the game. At all. Apparently, we can't find the sweet spot. There we go. Max does look really weird, though. Someday, Dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well, I might just allow this one into the family album. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William is here. Yes, and we can't. Chloe is Chloe just a kid. Serve us slackers. Am I that What's far that? back in time? You mean pancakes? In France, yeah. they call them. Crimes. I'm 18 years old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said I love family. William like he was in my own family. I won't let him die today. I won't. Chloe is just so damn happy and carefree. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. I'll let her know that. Hmm. What can we do? What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with Chloe. Hello? Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, yeah. I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. My family never took fun, goofy photos like this. You yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Aha! You can't hide. I'll let her know that. Score! Mm. Mm. Hello. Hello. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the- I forgot about this. Back to the lighthouse. Two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course, I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. 
Be there shortly. Love you. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. Not just Chloe's. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. Ridiculous. <laughs> be That's crazy. a cool snow dough. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. You're bankrupting me. Oh, shit. I knew this thing would come in handy. How did my keys get in here? And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Shit. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. I forgot he had that stupid key thing in his. I have to try. I have to. I, I was put here to use this power to save William. For Chloe. Grateful for that someday. Shh. I need to go for the back. Come on. Where do I hide them so it's in case you can't hear the beefing? Outside, maybe? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hello? Yeah. Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous yeah. breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work. Throw keys. Yeah, throw keys. Throw keys. Had to get groceries. <laughs> I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh yeah, the bus is great. It comes every 15 minutes and there'll be plenty of room for you and Joyce and groceries oh. and, and it'll save the environment. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome! So we saved it, Dad. Uh. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? All my friends in LA told me that we're getting Max. wet and cold every day. But Never, like Maxine. I know, sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girl's potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like, whatever, bitch. Warren, he hooked up with Stella? Oh. Oh, no. This is totally fucked up. What else have I changed? Chloe.
You look so prim and proper. David's a bus driver instead of security. Okay. I do not remember all of this. What's happening? Why is it going weird on the frame? Yeah, sorry it's like zero noise right now. It's just... Um... I'd taken out all the copyright music, so I don't get a copyright claim. And I don't know why it's specifically glitching out on one point. <laughs> it's weird. Oh, never mind. I don't think there's any way for me to skip this, I'm afraid. So we're just going to have to talk while it's in case it's silent. Ooh, we're out on the beach. That's not good. If you guys do get a chance to play this game, the music is awesome as well. I do actually have the soundtrack because I like the music that much. Um, but I can't include it in the streams because it's just, it, I'll get copyright claimed. Unfortunately. I don't know if it's meant to be glitching out there. Like it's part of the rewind thing. Yeah. Max Caulfield taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe! You have a visitor! And we've completed that episode. Again, I'm sorry there's no music. Um, I am actually going to leave it there tonight, guys. Um, I've got some pain in my jaw. No, I'm really sorry. I'm going to leave it there. Um, we will start on the next episode next time. Um, but I hope you enjoyed the stream. Sorry I didn't talk as much. Um... But I will speak to you all next time. Let's see what, let's just have a quick look at this. Uh, oh yeah, the money in the office, we left that. A lot of people kiss Chloe. Not many people sided with David. We kept the dog from getting hurt. I knew if we threw it in the radio, it would go and get hurt. Chloe has to come back. Swap me to this. Lisa is alive. I think that was the plant. Yeah, we changed his grade, didn't we? Uh, put ourselves on the party list. 
We could have erased names. Oh, cool. I should have done that. We erased the cop sounds. That's good because that helps Chloe not get into trouble. Most people seem to help Alicia. We did. Ah, oh, we didn't help the homeless woman. Shit. I did take the photo in the past, but then I had to rewind so it's in case I didn't. I didn't leave a mark on the fireplace. I don't know how you could leave a mark on the fireplace, but okay. And this is what happens next time. Oh, that looks fucked up. I do remember parts of this game, but I seem to be forgetting some of it as well. Um, but it, I do love this game. Um, the very first life is dream. And I love how... I love that it, she's a photographer. She's where she is. And she's reconnecting and saving her best friend starts this whole thing. Um... Which I think is pretty awesome. Um, but as I said, next time we will start this next episode of episode number four, I believe it is. Um, we'll try and do the whole episode in one go. Um, we may not make it, but we will definitely try. But I will speak to you guys later. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Bye, guys.